Welcome to Chapel, our online people, and all our students. Well, we're going to just take a minute, let them move out of that bright sun. That's good. I like it when you're closer to me anyway. Oh, that's okay. I'll talk louder. <laughs> so silly. Uh, I know. Oh, this is good. It's good to see all of you. Mrs. Messina is going to get a microphone for me. But while she's doing that, I will say once again, welcome to chapel. Boys and girls, I know I don't understand it, and I don't think you do either, how blessed we are to be able to worship God the way that we do. There are some places in the world where worshiping God is against the law, and people have to hide to do it. We can do this freely, and so we want to thank God for that. Here we go. Thank God for the safety. Okay, would you open in your All God's People Sing to page 16, the Liturgy of Praise. We know this, but we want to sing it with a little bit of joy. When we praise someone, we tell them how wonderful they are, and there is no one like God. So I will read the leader part, and you will be the people. Let's, let's praise God. In the name of God the Father, praise to our creating God. In the name of his Son, Jesus, praise to our redeeming God. In the name of God the Spirit, praise to our renewing God. Let us join our thankful praise. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Now, Miss Rose could not be with us this morning, so you are stuck with me. Our hymn of praise, usually we say it, but today we're going to sing it. And I'm going to sing the leader part along with my friend, surprise, Mrs. Salyam in the front row, <laughs> and you will sing the Alleluias. This is a little bit more peppy when we sing it. So, Mrs. Salyam, will you start, and you and I will sing the leader part, and then you guys will sing the Alleluias. And teachers, lead the way on the Alleluias. Okay. Uh, from all the world. Okay, ready? <laughs> From all that dwell below the skies, let the Creator's praise arise. Alleluia, Alleluia. Let the Redeemer's name be sung through every land by every tongue. Your turn. Alleluia, 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 Alleluia. Eternal are your mercies, Lord. Eternal truth attends your word. Your turn. Alleluia, Alleluia. Your praise shall sound from shore to shore, till sun shall rise and set no more. Your turn. Alleluia, 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 Alleluia. Alleluia. Will you pray with me? Praise to you, O Lord, for your daily goodness and mercy. Renew our hearts with thankfulness to you. Alert us to the needs of others around us. 
Inspire us to worship you in spirit and in truth. Save us from our own sins, from death and from the devil. Energize us for service and for witness. Okay, you guys with your hymnals, now we all sing this last verse together, same tune. Are you ready? Here we go. All praise to God the Father be. All praise eternal Son to thee. Alleluia, alleluia. Oh, with the Spirit we adore. Forever and forevermore. Alleluia, alleluia.
that when the rains came and the winds blew and the water came up, the house stood firm. But, Jesus said, if anybody hears my words and doesn't listen to them and doesn't obey me, it's like a person who built his house on a hunk of sand. The rains came, the winds blew, and guess what happened to the house? The plot. It fell down with a great crash. Boys and girls, I brought a rock and I brought sand to show you. Are you ready to see this? Yeah. Oh, good. I'm glad. I hope most of you can see. I'm going to scooch my little table over. There we go. All right. Here's, oh my goodness, it's so heavy. Here's my rock. Could you feel, hear how heavy it was? All right. Now the sand is pretty heavy too. And it looks pretty strong right now, doesn't it? They look about the same. Do you think that sand is strong enough to hold anything? Well, maybe it could hold a piece of paper. But that's about all. What will happen when that sand, when, let's pretend this is rain. What will happen when it rains on that sand? What do you think? Ariana, what will happen? Let's see. Oh, look at that. It's falling apart. What will happen when it rains on the rock? Juliana, what do you think? It'll get wet, but it won't, it won't get wrecked. Look at that. When we follow Jesus' words, when we pray for those who are mean to us, when we say, Jesus, I'm so worried about this, but I'm going to give my worries to you, we are building our life on the rock. Jesus will never, ever fail us. He is the rock of our salvation. He's the rock of our life. And then, when we build our life on that rock, then our light can shine for Jesus, too. We can be a light in this dark world. And we can share his love with others not because we're so strong, but because he's so strong. And he can help us do that. So the next time you feel like being mean to your friends, or talking back to your mom, or worrying about something, stop and think, am I building my life on this old, mushy sand? Or am I going to build my life on the rock? Jesus is our rock, and we want to build on him. So let's see what's next on my list here. Ah, let's open up our, our hymnals back to page 17. Oh, I always think it's this stuff. Okay, let's do the psalm of praise, okay? I'll be the leader, you be the, you be the peppy people, okay? Praise God. Praise God. Praise Him in His holy temple, in the firmament of His power. Praise God. Praise Him for His mighty acts and His excellent greatness. Praise God. Praise Him with the blast of the trumpet, with lyre, with harp, and with timbrel and dance. Praise God. Praise Him with strings and organs and with loud resounding cymbals. Praise God. Let everything that has breath praise him. Praise God. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Now we're going to sing our hymn of the month, Come Let Us Worship. And I don't even, at least I don't think you need your hymnals, but if you do, it's number 86. And I know a lot of you know this one by heart. So we're just going to do it. Number 86, come let us worship the Lord together. I think somebody knows that one, don't they? Okay, here we go. 
Come, let us worship the Lord together. Let us sing his praise forevermore. When the family of God comes together, we love to sing his praise forevermore. Alleluia. will be going to a place that helps people who cannot get to the eye doctor. If your eyes are getting weak or you need glasses, we go to the eye doctor and we get glasses. Lots of us wear glasses or contacts. But there are places in the world where people, there aren't any eye doctors and people can't get any help for their eyes. So our money is going to go to help them. And if in your house somebody has old glasses that they don't need anymore, these are my old glasses, you can bring those. And we'll give those to the people too. And then they'll take them and give them to someone who needs glasses. The other thing you can do is if you're maybe at Target or the dollar store and you see regular sunglasses for children or grown-ups. We're going to collect those too because many of these people live in places that are really bright and sunny all the time and the sunglasses will help them protect their eyes from that bright sun. You don't have to buy a hundred of them. You could just share and buy one pair. That would be wonderful. So if that's what our money and our gifts are going for this time around. So don't forget to do that. Let's bow our heads and we will say Luther's morning prayer together and then the Lord's prayer. So let's fold our hands. I thank you, my Heavenly Father, through Jesus Christ, your dear Son, that you have kept me this night from all harm and danger. And I pray that you would keep me this day also from sin and every evil, that all my doings and life may please you. For into your hands I commend myself, my body and soul and all things. Let your holy angel be with me, that the evil foe may have no power over me. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. And now, boys and girls, it's time to send you back to work. So, go in peace, in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Our closing hymn will be number 103, Go Now in Peace. And I
I'm pretty sure you hardly need your hymnal for this one. We'll sing this through two times. Go now in peace. Ready? Go now in peace. Go now in peace. May the love of God surround you everywhere, everywhere you may go. Go now in peace, go now in peace. May the love of God surround you everywhere. Build your life on the 